Jojo, for the last three years, I've been trying to get an interview with you. Get out I, of town. I remember the first time when we, we, we it was briefly, okay. it was at Boots and Hearts. Okay. Yeah. And we were supposed to do an interview there. Every time we were supposed to do an interview, it never came about. Something happened. But I'll tell you something. Every time I mentioned your name about to somebody, they always said, this guy is the next big thing coming back. Come on, man. You don't have to say that, man. Oh, shoot. That's, that's Keith Urban. I don't know if y'all know that. I'm, I'm fan girl, but hey, man, thank you so much. That, that means a lot to me, man. No, it's true, because people talk about your story. They yeah. talk about um, your music, and, you know, being in country, it's, it's, it's a whole combination, man. Yes, How does it feel bringing country music, but with a different level and a little bit of different taste to it? I just try to do me, man. I just try to put me in everything that I do, and, and I feel like my music really reflects that. We got some new stuff coming out, man. I'm really excited for you to see. Really excited for y'all to hear this one. So it's going to be great. It's going to be crazy, but that's how I do it. I just try to put me in everything that I do. You know what I mean? No, I'm just don't. Uh, are you nominated tonight? I'm not nominated, but I do get to present an award with my boy Gore Bam, but I'm who I'm going on tour with. Oh, wow. In October, we on the road for two months, coast to coast, and we about to hit it, man. Yeah, have you guys known each other for a long time? Like, yeah, how did this all come together? Um, haven't known him for a long time, but I've known him for a little while. He messaged me uh, about a month and a half ago and uh, said, hey, man, what, what you up to this fall? I said, shoot, not much. What you up to? He said, I got an opportunity for you. I would love, love for you to come on tour with me. I said, hands down, no questions asked. Let's get it done, and we got it done, man, and we're making it happen. I love that, man. Yes, I love that's that. It, brother. Dude, look, I know you got more things you got to do, and I don't want to keep you here, but one thing I noticed, though, last time I saw you, man, you've been hitting the gym. I've been trying. Hard. You've been hitting the gym hard. I've been hard. trying, man. I've been trying. I'm, I'm working with uh, with Box to Fit out in Vancouver, man, and these guys are incredible. They do a, a program for Parkinson's. Um, I don't know if you know Muhammad Ali. He uh, died yeah. with, with Parkinson's as well. It crippled his career, and so they're taking uh, – quite a time quite a, a an amazing thing and help and putting it to use man so i'm just so lucky i get to be a part of it and you know got got to look good with for the people it's man looking, <laughs> it's looking good on you my friend look we got to do this again i want to sit down chat okay. talk about the whole career because like i said man your background and what you bringing now to country music is amazing man have a great time tonight yeah, appreciate you baby oh, thank you man thank you thank you seeing you man how does it feel this is something you're used to you wanted to see cmas in the past i mean how does it feel being part of all this it's great man it's uh it actually feels good this year it's first time in eight years i haven't played on the show so uh looking forward to just being a presenter and taking it all in no pressure tonight well look man you may not be playing or doing anything tonight here but uh, you had your, uh, you, you were giving back to one of the hospitals in, in Hamilton, yeah, right? I was here at the hospital, Children's Hospital, and we had uh, spent a couple hours there in the afternoon and, uh, you know, um, give back to their uh, music therapy program again this year, another 10000 so that's $30,000 uh, in, in uh, Hamilton. In fact, we started that program there, so we're proud of that as the Gord Bamford Foundation, and we uh, continue to give back to kids and youth across Canada, which is very important to us. I love it. Were you golfing also? I wasn't sure. I was golfing. I was golfing, but uh, if you want to call it golf, I was I was riding the cart, making a few, you know, hit the ball off the tee a little bit, but that's about it. Well, look, man, when you look at all this great Canadian talent, and you've been doing this for a long time, my friend, what are your thoughts on seeing how things have progressed, you know, from the legends that we've had on this red carpet to, I mean, folks like yourself who's continuing this, this, this great tradition? Yeah, I mean, it's a massive business here in Canada, and... Uh, compete with anything in the world and we continue to have uh, you know the artists that have uh, been a mainstay here for many years you know like myself that's been very fortunate and continue to have the fan support and we got lots of great up-and-coming artists that you're gonna see tonight which I think is great at the CC May to you know to, to put some new new acts on and then lots of lots of women on the show tonight which I think is important and Absolutely. you know I think it's uh yeah it's gonna be great okay new music what's going on with that my friend well dive bar is set to hopefully go number one next week so we're excited about that at, at radio and uh, um, uh, working on a new project, but we're just gearing up for this uh, underplay here 
this honky tonk and dive bar tour that's just been selling like gangbusters. So we're yeah, looking and I understand that certain somebody who I just spoke with is going to be part of My this. My brother from another mother is what there he says. Yeah, man, Mr. Jojo Mason is coming out, and you know, I just it's nice being around a guy that's very positive and uh, he's talented. So I'm looking forward to having him out. Now he said he didn't really know who you. Like, how did this come together? I just met him a couple times. You know, I really liked him, and and uh, you know, we're looking for somebody that has been working hard that. You know, could use the exposure and get out in front of people, and you know, it's obviously a different. Uh, you know, it, that's the thing. It's not going to be a different crowd of people. I mean, country music fans are country music fans, and I think that uh, for him to come out, he's going to be part of the show. He's not an opening act. He's coming out, and he's going to have video, and he's going to be part of the 90-minute show with our band. And he's a great guy, so I think it's going to bring a great, uh, a great demo. You know, demographic of the show is going to be pretty cool. You know, it's going to be different and. Uh, He's going to make people laugh and, and do his good, a job like he always does, so it's going to be great. Looking forward to it, my friend. Look, have a great time tonight, man. Always great seeing you. Yeah, thanks. Good to see you.